Craig here again on the sixth stop, stop number six of West Coast Tour from Canada down to Mexico, testing for radiation readings at beaches. We are in Grays Lake, Washington, uh, about two thirds of the way down the state, Grays Lake, Washington. There is no real good landmarks here other than one thing to demonstrate, to prove where I'm at. And that's off in the distance on the shore here. We have four mid-sized wind generators. And luckily it's not very windy today. A lot of people digging for clams out here this morning. I believe that's what they're doing. In any event, let's begin. Now hopefully, there's no sun today here right now, so hopefully you can see these numbers okay. Got about a block or so to walk to the beach. We're heading towards the beach. This is in micro Rentkins, six micro Rentkins currently. This is in Councilman, it's currently 18. I can't read them, I'm not sure. And uh, if you don't know what's going on with this rig here, I've already had a lot of comments on my uh, other videos that I've done up to now. Go to the description box uh, on this video, on all the videos, and you will see there is a, uh, a link where you find out exactly what I'm doing here, what these numbers mean, and what I, how I had these machines set up. Everything's uh, up and up here, open book. I want everybody to understand what's going on. So check the link out below. Okay, we're done going to the water's edge as usual. And you see the numbers are not fluctuating. Kind of calm seas this morning, not a whole lot of wind. And we've got some water here. So let's stop right here and take a look. I'm hoping you read it. Seven micro Renkins, 20 pounds per minute. Now we're up to 10, 12, and 19 over here. Let's get a little closer to the water. Even though there's not going to be any radiation in the water with the Geiger counter either, let's uh, make sure we get some water under there so you people, so the trolls aren't going nuts. As you see, no difference. And in fact, there can't be any difference if you understand how radiation behaves. Here comes a big wave. Uh, Geiger counters got a little wet from splashing, but I think they'll be fine. As you see, I'm standing uh, in ankle deep water right now, and there's no, no increase in radiation. Okay, now as usual, hopefully that water will come right off. Let's go back towards the shore. And I'm gonna do double time here again. Saves time on this video. I am running. Except to find where I left my shoes. There they are. Left my shoes and the Fiesta Wear plate. Again, go to the description uh, box below this video and you can see about the Fiesta Wear plate and why I do it at the end of each of these videos. Okay, but we're on current. I'm sorry. Uh, before I do that, I want to do an average. Seven micro Renkins. That's what's going to be recorded. Seven micro Renkins on the Mazur. On the GQ, 17.25. 17.25. Switch back to. And switch this back to current. And go at the plate. Thanks for watching.